Hi guys, we are preparing for the release in the beginning of May. Our ISOs are on AEG. I'm going to make a video for our end users as well. This is a, view, a video I've made for the beta testers at some point in time. But it actually is a question that probably will come up anyway from users. So we have the Arclex ISOs. We have three of them. This is our development ISO. So these three guys, that's it. And the question will be, what's the difference in packages? And the best thing is to just go to the package list. And this you can do yourself, of course, in the future. You just grab the package list of Arconet. You grab the one from Arco Pro. And this was the question back then. What's the difference between Arconet and Arco Pro? At some point in time, well, after, the, after making the video, it's about 300 megabytes. That means there must be packages. So this is the one that we're going to release beginning of May. So let's revisit it again. So the Arco Net is going to be the easy one. Everything is working. Bluetooth printers, you name it, it's all there. And there is a there are theming and rising things here. So it starts off with an icon with themes for Alacrity, for sound and for packages like Arch Linux logout, how to log out of things. And uh, AppGlade is here, Arc. So the, we do want to promote our apps. So by default, they're on there, AppGlade, but the Pro is intended as a bare minimal thing. So we're not going to include uh, several apps that we have created, but we'll put them on Plasma and on Net. So things like these, all Arconic stuff, those were decisions that we say we want to have that and that. Bluetooth is on here. Arconic D, previously, right? Arco Pro does not have anything regarding Bluetooth and sound and all that. So you need to figure that all out. There is nothing for conkeys on the Arco Pro, etc. etc. So everything that's green is more, is extra on the net compared with the pro version. So you can through go through the list. So there's no Discord here and etc. No events here. There is nothing FF MPEG here. File roller is not there. Firefox, forget about it. So the bare Arco Pro is what we're looking at, right? This is the, the proof that the Arco Pro is very, very minimal. So all kind of things, GNOME Bluetooth is here again. These are dependencies and the key ring is here. Well, lots of things and I'll just scroll on and tell a few of those. My three lock is there, yes, sure. Some of them we don't recognize and other ones we immediately say, oh, that application, all libraries, libraries, libraries. Every single choice brings in maybe, right? A dependency, a library. So Lua is in here, Mario Libre, it's XFCE. That's a full one, the one that actually is complete. And the mugshot is here, things for XFCE. And more design, Numix icons. We want to have something nice after .NET, .NET, Arconet. We want to have something nice. And here's Pavu Control. Sound, Pulse Audio, Poplar is here. All Python stuff. Lolcat is here. This is Ruby things. I think it's Lolcat. And then uh, SMB Client is in here. Scanning something is in here. So blind like text and editor is in here, it's not there. Telegram is not in the Arco Pro. And this gives you an overview and also for the future, right? Things will change because making a distro is making choices all the time. And yeah, sure, the list that we're looking at now will change in the future. But you do the same thing I've done right now. You download all the information you can get online. And the package list is here and the other package list is here and you just compare and if you compare of course the plasma with this one you'll see 
we'll just let's quickly do it you'll see a lot of kde stuff right so if you compare and you say well let's well, let's uh, remove this one this one with that one compare let's go to the k <laughs> letter k voila right it's normal that in, on the plasma iso there will be a lot of packages start at the wing k from kde and the p sometimes as well plasma 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 of course that we don't have them on the arconet okay so that's how you can do things um, just melt it it's an application that we have you can install it if you don't have it compare and done cheers